There are two types of links that you will want to add to your web page, absolute links and relative links. Relative links are when you link to another page that is on your website. So you're simply linking to another page that you've created. Now to do this, you can go ahead and you can select the text that you want to link and then go down to your link um, text box on your properties pane and if you know what you want to link to then you can go ahead and just put the name of that page followed by .html press enter and that will be your new link now if you want to go ahead and browse for a file you could click on this button and it will bring up your select file box you could go ahead and then click on the page that you want to link to and then click on OK and it will go ahead and link to that page. Now also in your, your website you will want to link to absolute links and these are links that are other web pages. They're not on your site. So to do this go ahead and select what you want to link and then you could go ahead and you can type in the address in the link text box and you just type it in and you have to include the HTTP colon slash slash and then the address press enter and that will be your new link. Now another way that you can do it is you can select your text right here and this works for both absolute and relative links. Go ahead and up on your common bar click on hyperlink and it shows you what text you want to display as the hyperlink which is what's going to be shown on your web page. The link and we're going to go ahead and put this in here And if I wanted to choose a relative page, then I could go ahead and click this box and I could browse for a relative page. The target, do I want for it this link to open in a blank page, as a parent page, as a self page, or as a top page? I can go ahead and set that here. I can also choose a title for that link if I want an access key and a tab index if I want. So if you want any of those advanced options then you could go ahead and set them here. Go ahead and click OK and you've now set your absolute link so that's going to um, go ahead and link to the website techtutor.tv.